Hi guys, it's Mitty and this is Mitty Stock slash Hit Live. This series is totally separated from Generation Q. As the name indicates, Generation Q is a limited series with no set numbers of episodes. It will roll until it doesn't. Generation Q was a starting point for me, an excuse, if you like, to release my podcast. As I mentioned like a million times already that Hosting a podcast is one of my oldest dreams, and I use this crisis to create Generation Q and step out of my comfort zone. And this is actually about Hit Life, the original subtitle of Mitty Stock, podcast called Mitty Stock, and having subtitles, having subcategories series is uh, through the main podcast it allows me to dive into uh, different interesting subjects i felt the time has come to bring hit life series alive as the name indicates to the hit workout high intensity interval training and it's one of well, for me, is one of the hardest type of workout. It requires a lot of practice of movements, breathing techniques, and finding myself limited by it, which makes me want to break through and feel free. Just like in life, we live our lives through limits and battles, and we keep fighting, keep going until we break through all those obstacles and set out another new destination. Hit Life is covering my personal growth and I'm sharing what helps me to grow, to become a better version of myself. I've written a few blog posts on blogain.co.uk and I wanted for a long time to create video and audio version as well so I'll be able to reach more people with my content. And this is what I'll be doing going through my previous contents and recreate the message. The first entry to this series is very, very close to my heart for so many reasons, obviously, and it's one of my favorite posts as well. I think it's perfect for the first hit life entry. But let's dive into and go back to 8th of February 2019. And if you like, we are going back to the future. And that's one of my favorite movies all time. Marty McFly. It's nearly one and a half year ago now, yeah? Uh, I already was talking about potential within ourselves. But let's see what I was actually thinking. Potential is you. Potential is one of the most wonderful words in any language. It looks forward with optimism, it filled with hope, it promises success, it implies fulfillment. Potential is a word based on possibilities. I have a desire to reach my potential, so the question is, how do I do it? I have no doubt that the answer is growth. To reach my potential, I must grow. And to grow, I have to be highly intentional about it. But what do I mean? To discover my purpose, I need to grow in self-awareness. To become a better human, a better version of myself, I have to grow in character. In every area of life, in career, I have to grow skills. To be a better partner or parent, I have to grow in relationships. To reach financial goals, I have to grow knowledge how money works. To enrich my soul, I must grow spiritually. To all that, I have to put in the, into work to actually grow. I believe I do my work on that slower than I actually expected, but the progress is there. And not just me who can see it. And I think that's just the bonus. You cannot change your life until you change something you do every day. By learning the law of growth and living by them, I'll be on my way to reach my potential. But how do I know if I find my purpose? And to be honest, I don't know yet. But I want to believe that I'll feel it when I do. My life is constantly changing. I've changed. And even bigger changes in the picture. And that is my potential of better self and better life. 
my potential is like a kite, will fly high, but only with my control. I am the one who controls my mind and my potential. I am the one who controls the kite, how far and high it flies. But to order to be able to fly a kite, I must learn and practice every day to do so, to learn how to control it. With everything in life takes time, practice and patience, which I have the less of, to be honest, but takes self-awareness and self-discipline to get better in anything, actually. Sometimes my circumstances in life makes my journey way too hard and a lot of times I feel like giving up and just like, fuck it. But then I always remember why I even started to walk on this path and where did I already got from the, from the start. And even though I had, and I am 100% that I will have even more extremely hard times, I did and I will do enjoy each moment of it because I've got to learn about myself. Well, actually, I do lie now. I never enjoy the hard times at the moment. When I have time to calm down, then I I start to be able to see that actually those roadblocks is, is for my growth. I know I'll be tested on my way to my destination. And even now, at this moment, I'm being tested. But the real thing is that I know what I need to learn from my current situation. That fills me with excitement, really, because I already starting to see the opportunity to grow in every moment of my life. I am living with with open mind and open eyes. I am becoming more self-aware each moment of my life. And that is my friend is a wonderful feeling. It makes me feel I am I am in control with myself and with my life. But getting to the end of this entry, I think I am actually find my purpose already. So easy and simple and it's right in front of my eyes. I can create my potential. Whoever I want to become or whatever I want to achieve, I will as long as I stay as working in progress of my own to reach my potential. Potential is me. Potential is you. Thank you so much for being here. Please, please share your thoughts down the comment section below. Thank you. Peace and love, Mitty.